And then was blonde, buxom. There was a look that was marketable. I made the movie and then decided I never wanted to make another movie again and went to Broadway and did a series of plays on Broadway. And then only came back to Hollywood because I was offered the part of a whore. And here was a chance to not be the girl next door. You know, here was a chance to say, I am more than Henry Fonda's daughter. Stardom, however limited, was exhausting and confusing. And the whole thing, all the hubbub and the talking about yourself and talking to journalists and all that kind of thing, it's, of course it's satisfying in a way because uh, we actors have horrible egos. And on the other hand, it's a complete separation. I don't feel when I'm doing all of this, it's not really me. I think I'm telling you the truth. I think I'm telling you what I think. But maybe I'm playing a game, you know. Maybe every single thing that I've said in front of that camera since I first saw you at the airport is a game. Because some of the time I feel that I'm, I'm what I think I am. And another time I think that I am constantly playing a game. But, but uh, maybe everybody thinks that way. Despite obvious affectations, Jane still had no idea who she was or what she was. Where better to go then but to France, where sexy young nymphettes, even American ones, are national treasures. Did you know there's a 